Welcome sa sipnain.com This video tutuloy natin yung ating series on quadrilaterals no? and sa video na to ay magpuprove tayo ng another uh, uh, theorem in uh, sa parallelogram no? so dito prove natin that if a quadrilateral has two sets of opposite sides congruent then it is a parallelogram yung Q, Q, U, 04 kapareho nito pero baliktad doon sa Q, U, 04 ABCD sa paralelogram ay ipuprove natin that the opposite sides are congruent. So, magkaiba yun, ano? Magkaiba, magkaiba itong dalawang yun. Ito, iba ito. Ito, ang ipuprove natin na pag meron kang opposite sides na congruent, ay meron kang paralelogram. Okay? So, we have um, our proof, which are our statements, and our reasons, no? So, pwede natin kopyahin na lang itong given, no? Kasi gamitin natin ito sa proof. So, pwede natin kopyahin. And, you know, we know that uh, yung given natin. Okay. So, isa sa mga statements natin ay AB is congruent to DC and AD is congruent to BC. So, opposite. Uh, opposite uh, sides are congruent of this quadrilateral. So, reasons given. Hindi mo pwedeng sabihin na ang reason mo ay uh, definition of parallelogram. Ano? Remember, parallelogram yung pinaprove natin. At ang definition lang ng parallelogram ay op opposite sides are parallel. So, hindi natin siya pwedeng gamitin as reason. So, given siya. Hindi pa natin alam na parallelogram dito sa pinaprove natin. Malalaman natin later, no? Next, we have, uh, oh, we draw AC also. We can draw AC. Draw AC. This is by uh, postulate 1 of Euclid. Sabi ni Euclid, pag may dalawa kang points, pwede ka mag-draw ng line. Connecting, connecting them no? or line passing through them. So, yan yung ating reason sa pangalawang statement natin. Pangatlong statement, we have triangle. Actually, pwede yung una to eh. Pwede una rin to. Pwede sila magkabaliktad. Next, we have triangle. O, oh, wala pa. AC pa muna. AC is congruent to to, at, to, at, to itself. May reflexive reflexive identity So a segment is congruent to itself no Ako ay kasintangkad ng sarili ko no? Next Okay Notice that I think I need a different color Notice that from the given, AB is congruent to BC. So this is, this is congruent to this. Alam natin yan kasi given siya. Parehong kulay, parehong ninth. So here, alam din natin that DC or AD is also congruent to this one. Tama? Next, we have uh, maybe some blue. This one is connected, is congruent to itself. So, ano meron tayo? Meron tayong three pairs of sides which are congruent. So, one pair, two pairs, congruent. Tsaka this one is, pair din sila kasi yung, yung AC ng triangle ADC, tsaka yung AC rin ng triangle ABC. So, dalawang triangles, may pareho ko silang side. So, ibig sabihin, tatlong pairs of sides are congruent. Pairs of sides. So, triangle ABC is congruent to triangle CDA. By ano to? By SSS congruence. Ito yung S natin, ha? Congruent ito. Congruent ito, tsaka congruent ito. 
Yan yung tatlong S natin. Tatlong sides. Tatlong pairs of sides are going to be. What else? Okay? So, pag pag congruent sila, what do we know? Ano ang, alam natin yung i-detect natin yung corresponding angle ng dalawang triangle. Dito, asan ang corresponding angle nito? Green tsaka blue. Asan yung green ng, and blue dito? This one, di ba? So, angle 1 corresponds to angle 2, kunwari. What about this one? Anong corresponding angle nito? Uh, parang, ano ba to Pitch and blue. Asan ang pitch and blue dito? So, this one, maybe I'll, I'll use a different color. This uh, one, I'll use pink. I'm always a lover of pink. Three and four. No? Are con congruent, no? So here, these are statements and reasons. Reasons. Maybe I just have to move a little bit. Oops. Statements and reasons. So angle one is congruent to angle two. And angle 3 is congruent to angle 4. And why is that? Ano reason natin dyan? We have corresponding parts. Corresponding parts of congruent triangles. Congruent triangles are congruent. So, nakita niya naman, di ba? Based on sa discussion kanina that these uh, two pairs of triangle, uh, pa angles are congruent. Now, notice that this one is congruent to this one, but these are alternate interior angles, no? Alternate interior angles siya. Pag ito yung line ko at ito yung transversal ko, these two are alternate interior angles. And these two are also alternate angles. Pag ito. Diba? Ibig sabihin, parallel itong line na to. Diba? Pag kung magkukongruent lang alternate interior angles mo, pag parallel yung line mo, pag hindi parallel yung line mo, for example, ganito tsaka ganyan, tapos nagkumuha ka ng transversal, these are the two, these are the interior angles. no? These are the interior angles, for example. This one, and this one. Definitely, hindi yan congruent. And this one, and this one. Hindi akong congruent kasi hindi sila parallel. Pero from here, no, alam natin that congruent sila. Congruent ito sa congruent yan. Pareho sila alternate, alternate interior angles. Therefore, AB is AB is parallel to CD or DC. No? And also, ano pang alam natin? Pag ito naman yung side natin, at ito naman yung transversal, pwede pa rin naman to na yung 1 tsaka 2 ay alternate interior pala. And angle 3 tsaka angle 4 pa rin. Is Remember ito ah, ito na yung ating line. Kung mara, wala yan. So, these are two alternate interior angles pa rin. So, since equal pa rin sila, this line is also parallel to this line, which means that this side is also parallel to this side. So, meaning, AC, ito AB kanina at saka DC, di ba? Which means that AD is also parallel to. Saan so, yung parallel ng AD? BC. So, ano to? Alternate Alternate Interior Angles of parallel lines are congruent. No? Pag, pag congruent sila, then these are parallel lines. And since opposite sides are parallel, no? 
Ang symbol pala ng parallel yung ganito, no? If this is parallel to this one, and this is parallel to this one, then their opposite sides are parallel. Pero ano ba yung definition ng parallelogram, di ba? Parallelogram, ang de pinaka-definition niya is that the opposite is a quadrilateral whose uh, opposite sides are parallel. So, A, B, C, D is a parallelogram. By definition, by definition, ito yung reason natin. Remember pa, lagi tayo may reason, no? Anong definition na yun? A parallelogram. is a quadrilateral whose opposite sides opposite sides are parallel. So by definition, ABCD is a parallelogram dahil dito sa dalawang ito. No? Yan pala natin yan ang ganyan. Okay? So I hope meron kayo natutunan sa uh, video na to. Maraming salamat and uh, see you in the next tutorial.